Malik started as a sixth grader, um, so he had played for a, a, about a year and, and not even fully a year. And I know that MISO is always looking for trombone players. I had some previous students who were um, currently in MISO, put the paperwork out and said, hey, give it a try. My initial thought was, that, oh, that sounds cool. I didn't give it all, the entire amount of thought until I took it home to my mother and I just showed it to her and just kind of casually talking about it. And she said, I, she really said, I think you should do it. My name is Megumi Kanda and I'm the principal trombone player of the Milwaukee Symphony and I also enjoy teaching a lot of young people. Working with Megumi, I mean, number one, I've, I feel, you know, not to be boastful, but I feel like I've become grown exponentially from where I was when I started with her. I mean, my, my trombone skills, I feel like, have developed so, uh, so much over this short amount of time. And I still have a long ways to go before I'm even close to the level that she's on. But coming to a place like MISO and being able to network um, and put your name out and study and learn from people like Megumi, um, conductors and players and people who are, who are doing the thing that we want to do, um, that's, that's really important for the young, uh, the, young the youth uh, who are in the orchestra, and that's something I found very valuable with this orchestra. So this is my laundry room where I normally practice. Um, I have to excuse the laundry, but I like it in here because that helps because we have this like tile up here on the ceiling, and between the hard tile floor and the tiled ceiling, it has a lot of reverb in it, and so it makes it a lot better to practice. The acoustics are a lot better. I'm blown away. And I'm, I'm completely impressed um, by the growth that I continue to continually see in him. Um, he really takes the initiative to pursue his passion. Um, we talk a lot about pursuing passion and, and linking that with your purpose in life. Um, and Malik really steps outside of the box and embraces that. What my soul has really done for Malik is it's brought together education, experience, and exposure. And those are three things that I try to instill in my children. And my soul brings that all together in one place. People take a completely vested interest in each and every child there, no matter what their uh, direction may be, what their interests may be, there's someone there pouring into them and helping them pursue their passion and their dreams beyond anything that he or I could ever give to him. And we're very grateful for that. As a father, you're just proud. You, you, you're proud and you're happy with the fact of, uh, of the young man that you're seeing him become. I think he can go anywhere he really want to go. Um, I think he got, you know, I think he got the right frame of mind. You know, I think he's definitely dedicated and committed, you know, to, to his craft. I think he can go anywhere he want to go.